This video will show you how to install Ring Video Doorbell 2 if you plan on connecting it to existing doorbell wiring. This is the installation you'll do if you want your internal bell to ring when someone pushes the button on the front of your Ring Video Doorbell 2. This is the battery. We recommend fully charging the battery before installation, even if you're wiring Ring to existing doorbell wires. Wiring your Ring Video Doorbell 2 ensures that your internal bell will ring. Plug the charging cable into the battery. While charging, both the red and green lights will light up. When only the green light is lit, it's completely charged. Slide the battery back into the compartment. You'll hear a click when the battery's secure. After inserting the battery, it'll take about a half a minute for your ring doorbell to power up. Before installation, complete the in-app setup of your ring doorbell indoors near your Wi-Fi router. If you need help, refer to our video on setting up your ring doorbell in the ring app. First, shut off power at the breaker. Remove your existing doorbell from the wall and disconnect the wires. Use your ring doorbell to mark the install location. If you're installing ring doorbell on stucco, brick, or concrete, then use the provided drill bit to drill holes into your wall and insert the included anchors into the holes. If you're installing on wood or siding, you don't need the anchors and can screw your ring doorbell directly into your wall. The optimal installation height for ring doorbell is four feet off the ground. If you're installing ring doorbell to existing wires that are higher than four feet, Use the wedge mount to angle it down to improve your view. Now connect your existing doorbell wires. If you're wiring ring doorbell to existing wires, you'll need a transformer with a voltage of 8 24 volt AC. A resistor must be used if you're wiring directly to a transformer. Please note that most intercoms and DC transformers are not supported. If your existing doorbell wires are too short to wire to ring doorbell, you can use these wire extensions and wire nuts to connect them together. To use the wire nuts, hold the wires together and twist the wire nuts clockwise over them until they're secure. Loosen the screws on the back of your ring doorbell and insert the spade connectors like this. After connecting the wires, Tighten both screws on the back of ring doorbell to ensure a good connection. If you're wiring ring doorbell to a digital bell, you'll need to install this diode. For more information, refer to our video on diode installation. You can also refer to the printed manual that came with ring doorbell if you need help. If you have a mechanical bell, do not install the diode because doing so can damage your bell. Then feed all the wires and wire nuts, if they were used, into your wall. Then secure your ring doorbell using the provided screws. Afterwards, install your faceplate by slotting it in at the top and clicking it into place. Finally, use the star-shaped end of the screwdriver to secure the faceplate with one of the provided security screws. Turn power back on at the breaker. The front light on your Ring Video Doorbell will illuminate. Congratulations! Your Ring Video Doorbell is now ready to use.